What's up everyone, it's Brandon Rowe here. I'm sitting with starting tight end for the York Lions, Nathaniel Griffin. How's it going, man? It's going all right, man. How are you? Pretty good. Now, um, you're pretty well known on campus and also on Twitter, and a lot of people are asking me, uh, hashtag different breed, what's up with that? <laughs> uh, hashtag different breed is just something that me and my friends, you know, we joke around about. Uh, pretty much what different breed stands for is just, you know, I feel like I'm the best. I feel like there's no one like me, and uh, I guess that's why I say it. Now, while uh, you just ended the season a couple months ago, um, Comparing it to how you anticipated the season going, did it go the way you wanted it? Well, you know, we fell short of a couple of things, but uh, at the beginning of the year I had a little bit of an injury, but I bounced back from it. I had a decent season, but definitely not attaining my goals that I set out at the beginning of the year, but still did all right. What about the team as a whole? The team as a whole, we definitely fell short. You know, we set a goal of making the playoffs, you know, trying to turn around the, the team, the atmosphere here at York. And uh, we fell a little bit short, but we definitely improved over the season's past. So I guess it was a step in the right direction. So this was your last year. Uh, you had the graduation game. You guys played Guelph. What was that like? What was the emotions going through your head when uh, that game was going on? Uh, it was tough. It was tough, you know, playing your last university game. You know, it's another chapter in my life finished. Uh, I definitely wish I could have done more here while I was here and, you know, had a bigger influence on the change in the program. But I think I, you know, stepped in, did my role, was a captain, you know, I help change the, the way the team was going, and hopefully, you know, the future builds from there. So obviously you are uh, the victim of the new eligibility rule. What, what are your thoughts on uh, that new rule? You know, I, it's tough for me to talk about that because <clears throat> if, you know, if I had another season, you know, that's another year for me to, you know, improve my draft stock and it sucks being a victim of it, but uh, hopefully they change the rule. It's still up for discussion. So if they do, you know, I'll be back for one more and we'll see what happens. What's next for Nathaniel Griffith? Uh, what's next for me is uh, May 7th, I uh, have a free agent camp. All the CFL scouts will be there, so you know, I'm going to go there and try to impress. Uh, I have a new company starting up called uh, Boke Boys Productions, and what we're doing is making uh, highlight tapes and you know, improving the marketability for Canadian players to go down south and even for CIS teams, and you know, that's the plan. All right, so that's all the time we have today. Uh, we want to thank Shake for coming out. If you want to follow him on Twitter, that's 8ngriff8. And uh, if you want to follow me, Brandon Row One. Thanks for watching.